And switching gears back to the remnants of this storm and a really fun aspect of this. New Yorkers obviously doing what New Yorkers do best tonight, finding a tough situation and just turning it into a party. Because down in Seagate in Brooklyn, one father is bringing the whole community together with an act of love that took hours but brought a whole lot of smiles. News 12's Hannah Kleeker tonight joins us from that pineapple by the sea. Hannah. Yes, Jessica, we were traveling around in Thunderbolt 12 and we came across this iconic, beautiful replica of SpongeBob's house. It took hours, apparently, of shoveling, of excavating and digging, but it was all inspired, as you're about to hear, by a father's love for his daughter. <laughs> Three-year-old Aaliyah had a vision, a pineapple under the sea, but it was her father, Oscar Risco, who turned that vision into a reality. It's for everybody here, so we, do, we love to do it. This enormous pineapple igloo stands in front of their Seagate home on the corners of Lime and Manhattan Avenues and, as you can imagine, has attracted the attention of dozens of neighborhood kids. It was awesome and amazing, but, but it's bigger than the other igloo that they made the last time. How many kids do you guys think can fit in here? I think about 15. That's a lot of kids. But you can't forget the neighbors. Right next door is Squidward's okay. Easter Island head house. I had to throw that in or she would have been angry with me. It would be nautical nonsense to think only the kids are having a ball with this. The community's beloved UPS driver, Tony, the one and only, stopped by to take a tour of Mr. Squarepants' humble abode. For the last seven years, this is my second family. You take a look at these kids here, Panther the kids, these kids here is what it's all about. He says after everything the community has been through, a little fun and laughter is just what they need. The community has found its way to uh, keep it going keep the fire lit, you know, as far as being neighborly and then friendly. As proof of this father's devotion, the outside of the igloo has an A carved over the entrance. What's your favorite part of all of this? Um, A. There's always an A for Aaliyah on every igloo. And the man who made this, Oscar Risco, says he's made several dozen igloos in his life. Obviously, it's a lot of work, but for him, it's a labor of love. In Seagate in Brooklyn, Hannah Klieger, News 12. I just can't stop smiling. Best story of the week. Hannah, thank you so, so much for taking us on that 